A roof collapsed because it was too far from any support. Okay, it's because of this uh, roofing thing again. Let's create no roof region. Create no roof region. There we go. Now it no longer looks like it's right. Um, it's quite a bit in over an overhang. Fast are these filling up? Right, those are filling up incredibly fast. I don't think there'd be any doubt of that. All right, so let's build some more. There we go. We double the number of batteries. Hopefully, will give us a bit more life during the night. Because that's actually getting to be a bit of a joke. Turn all those off. And there we go. Turn those off as well. No sense in using the power. You see those were filling up quite nicely, but as soon as night fell, they went thump. Definitely filling those up with a lot of power. Let's just watch those for a little bit and see what happens. We're actually getting close to year two of this. Well, we've successfully recruited Pan. Pan is a herbalist. So you can do the firefighting, you can do the doctoring. Don't want you doing any wardening because you're no skill at it. Backup grower. Don't know why I bother with that. Um, it looks like you're a hauler and our cleaner. There we go. And you can do other things if the need is there. Okay, where are you? In fact, who are you? Pan, that's it. Button down shirt, that's going to be great in a fight, isn't it? So let's get you some kits. How good a shirt shot are you? You're a terrible shot. Okay. Um, wear an armor vest. Wear a duster. Um, ba dum ba dum ba dum ba dum. Don't want to give you the M16, I want to give you that to someone with actual skill. There we go. Right, where are you guys off to? Mining stuff out about here, are you? Right. Okay, you cleared that out. Oh, we got plenty of metal, that's excellent. Right, we're down to one bed again, so another mining task is to get these next three, six beds done. Um, next construction task is sandbags. Oh, I'm seeing a problem there already. We'll just have to live with that, I'm afraid. See if a second row of sandbags does anything to help with this. Right, so what's this? Combat supplier is passing by. Barrow, where are you, matey? Uh, power's down anyway for the night. Okay, we're down to another one of these half second brown out things right this is going to have to be solved through more power generation isn't it uh, Barrow you're awake 
So you do, uh, you give them a call. And this round of building's done. We're just going to have to build a load more power uh, solar panels. Don't need any of that. You don't do that. And we'll have an M16. We we'll sell you a pistol. What did I actually sell you there? I don't know. I so that's it. We'll keep the rest of it. Okay. Something I particularly dislike is the way it jumps down. It's very hard to see what's going on there. And I think on a number of occasions I've actually killed the wrong uh, killed the wrong thing. I bought the wrong thing. Killed the wrong thing. Good lord. Uh, that's excellent, guys. You start digging your way out there. You need to get some more mining on, but let's clear that stuff out first. Builders are chugging away nicely. And looks like it's bedtime for everyone anyway. Power instantly goes down. Yep. Power generation, not storage. We must do something about that. So let's do that next. Power solar generators. One, two, three, four, five. Oh. Let's go to town. We got the metal to do it. Good, we almost got our launching pad sorted out. Running dangerously low on stone there, aren't we? Yeah, we seem to be storing a bit of uh, connecting rates. Uh, yeah. Definitely having problems there. It's just for a few seconds, but it's annoying few seconds, and it's going to get worse if we're relying on the power during combat. Uh, well, hopefully this will help. While I'm thinking about it. That will hopefully make us um, able to survive the door being knocked down. Excellent. You guys are doing that. You guys have nearly done that. Those walls are nearly done. Do we actually have anything left to research? Oh, I suppose we do actually have some stuff now, don't we? Uh, because of the mods. So let's get some of that stuff researched if somebody has a moment. Loads and loads of food. No prisoners anymore, which is excellent. Uh, I have an idea. Let's do something for morale here. Get that mined and just have a little alcove here. And we'll put some fun stuff in there. Group of tribes people, they are attacking immediately. Well, at least you're having the decency to come through the front door this time. Yeah. Well, at least that power is sorted out quickly. I don't think anyone's going to go on that at the front door, so let's just let. Things happen as normal for a bit. Come on. There we go. People force a, a, poise a door there, or we can try just trying a head to headbutt our way through this stone wall. Which one should we pick? Oh, I know. Let's try to headbutt our way through this stone wall. Right, you guys, turned on. 
Let's see if we actually have enough power for you now. Oh, and while I'm thinking about it... It's, it's, uh, actually, I don't need to select everybody, do I? I just want to turn repairing off. That way nobody tries to blindly wander into the area and sort out any of the destruction. Okay, let's get some people working. Tigress. Uh, let's get you drafted and let's get you up here so you can shoot at people. Now, so we got K. You can do the same, but over here. John. Likewise, let's get your big gun out there. Way, hey. Um, Raven, you can't shoot for Toffee. But Jono, you can. Let's get you involved in this as well. Alright, that'll do for now. Pull some more people if we think we need them. The tribesmen, and the big problem with tribesmen is the numbers. Kai, interesting name. That's it, guys. You wander in. You get panicky and or flee. Yeah, you see, it's just the sheer numbers are causing problems here. And admittedly, they're doing themselves damage, but that's not really helping me here because, yeah, they're just fleeing. Tigress, let's get you to safety. A little bit late. A group of friendly outlanders from the Sun's Tree have arrived nearby. They're moving to help you immediately. Thank you very much. A bit after the fact. Much appreciated, mind. Jono, please don't shoot Tigress. You'll only annoy her. Alright, definitely go back to the drawing board on this. Okay. You're one of ours. You pull back here. You decided you'd come out here, you can fight. Where's our colonist in need of rescue? Right, that could have gone a lot better. I think I need to undraft it. Uh, undraft this. I think I need to rethink this. Right. But you know what? I think I will do it next time. But before we go, let's have a look at the people we've rescued. Incapable of dumb labour, but a good miner. Yes, we will rescue you. Anyone else? Yes. Ham-fisted, vac-grown, muffalo shaman. Who's actually good at melee. Which is totally useless to us. But... You can do manual labour and that's good enough for me. Tigress, would you kindly capture this one? Is there anyone else? 
No. You know, this the thing is, this is working. This is defeating the attacks and we're getting some pretty big attacks now. Problem is, it's very expensive to repair it afterwards. So that said, we've got lots of metal, but we want to build a spaceship which is going to cost us lots of metal. Mm, I will rebuild it this time and we'll just have to rethink it, I think. Uh, okay, where are we? Okay, we have done well over an hour of this. I think I'm going to stop now. Plans are... Rebuild this, perhaps refine it. We've got plenty of power, which is good. I'm going to build a recreational area here with a couple of snooker tables and some nice chairs in. And we're going to want to start digging out these new bedrooms and also improving the existing bedrooms and making them a bit nicer. So there's still plenty more to come because at the same time what we want to do is start building a spaceship here so there we go ladies and gentlemen I think I'm gonna stop there I hope you've enjoyed this I certainly have I'm Simon Parsons this has been the room world thank you and good night